All right, guys, go to Boy 32 here. Check it out. So we're sitting up here at the Mifflin County Sportsman's Association. I'm working on the uh, T31A COG with ACSS reticle in it. Just got done running some targets up here, but I'll tell you what, man. You got some people over here blasting away at some steel behind you. Ran into some really cool cats uh, who also, by the way, are really big gun enthusiasts and have YouTube channels. So I felt it was my duty as, you know, a fellow YouTuber to, you know, let's do something jointly. So... You know, that's annoying. These people, don't they know we're trying to do a video Let's over go. here? Yeah. Yeah. Come here with some peace and quiet. Exactly. And all these people want to do is shoot. All right. So, <laughs> so anyway, this is Frank, and Frank has a YouTube channel hey called? Uh, Renaissance Firearms Instruction. It's uh, the video outlet to our instruction company based out of Long Island, New York. Long Island. All Long right. Long Island. And this is Chris, and he has a YouTube channel called? Tactical Outdoorsman. Also, uh... Off of an instruction company called Tactical Outdoorsman. <laughs> Outstanding. That's so funny because I people ask me, he goes, why aren't you an instructor or something? I go, you know what? There's a certain mindset for people who are instructors. And you can be a great shooter. You can be a horrible instructor. So that's one of the things is I'm a horrible instructor. Therefore, I don't instruct. Would you I'm agree? a great instructor that makes me a bad shooter. I can well, I don't works. necessarily understand know about that, but I can see where your command presence comes through in your instructional value. So tell me a little bit about your channel. We'll start off with you, Frank. Go ahead. So, Speak up so we can hear you. Okay? Yeah, you know, I know. Right? right? Oh, Go ahead. Shooting. You know, this is really a, a, a good argument for the uh, Hearing Protection Act because yeah. they wouldn't have to deal with this. We wouldn't have to deal with it. You guys wouldn't have to deal with this. Exactly. A <laughs> uh, little background. Well, Renaissance Firearms Instruction, it's, uh, it's kind of like the pet project that we have. You know, so we have, um, generally I like to take some gear in and we'll, we'll use it in classes and we'll get it in the hands of students. Yep. And then once in a while we'll have some gear that's just so extraordinary, we want to get more in-depth on it or we'll get students or we'll get fans that ask for more information on something. Um, I write for a number of publications too, so I'll wind up taking that gear and I feel like maybe this needs a little more spotlight. We'll throw together a video for right. it. Um, we love working with small companies. We like getting those guys involved. You know, I mean, a lot of times they don't have the... Uh, the opportunity or the budget to get into a big print publication so you know we kind of step in front of a, a decent audience doing that you know and nothing nothing's as good as hands-on touching and I, feeling. I totally so, agree you know, um, I like I'm that. very hands-on as well you know I like to touch yeah. everything so anyway Chris tell me a little bit about your channel and what you do uh, very similar to Frank's uh, you know I've been shooting with him for almost two decades. Speak up. Two they decades. won't be able to hear you yeah uh, I've been shooting with Frank for about uh, two decades <laughs> we're couple of old guys I uh, instructed for him and uh, I decided you know why not spin off start doing my own instruction uh, more one-on-one -on -one as opposed to a lot of the classroom stuff uh, large classes that he does uh, so I'm really focusing on the one-on-ones and uh, also just reviewing the products mm -hmm. uh, as I get them in I'm requesting from manufacturers just trying to get content out yeah. for the regular Joe he's actually sponsored by Spyderco for you guys that oh, don't okay. know that yeah um, in fact the knife that's in my back was made by them yeah Right. Oh, yeah. Tell me a little bit more about the knife in your back. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, I'd like to say I'm sponsored by a company as well. We call them... What is this? Oh. <laughs> Microtech. Anyway. <laughs> but anyway, guys, just wanted to uh, do a real quick video uh, showing you guys this one. Chris, you're out of the screen, so you need to come on over a little bit further. Oh, we are social go. distancing. This is all uh, done with uh, the magic of... Uh, what do you call that, the, the post-processing and things of that nature. But uh, it was really cool meeting some fellow YouTubers out here. And uh, Firearms Renas no, Renaissance Firearms Training. Instruction. Instruction. Renaissance Firearms Instruction. Yep. We're going to rename that 10 years ago. Yeah. Another, at our 20-year 20 20 year anniversary, I think we're going to well, you know what? The tactical um, outdoorsman. Tactical outdoorsman. <laughs> and then you're on Instagram as well. Yep. Uh, fire arms, Renaissance, Renaissance Firearms Instruction. There you go. RFI are you shooting. On are you on Instagram? Uh, yeah, Instagram, Facebook. YouTube. Awesome. You guys look these fellas up and uh, go, I'll put the link to their channels down below so you can go and subscribe. Show them some love, man. This is what it's all about and uh, in the community. And this is what I like to do is share the love. I would hug you, but they're from New York. <laughs> and, you know, anyway. So, yeah. all right. We'll, Y'all be good. We always end it like this. God bless America. God bless those men, women in uniform 24-7 who fight for our freedom. I'm talking about those cool cats and women. Not, I mean, well, you know, dogs. You know, you guys who uh, fight for our Constitution that was written by our founding fathers and not how it's tried to uh, be changed and misinterpreted by Governor Cuomo. Right. Yeah. So All right. Star. I am out of here. Y'all be good. Thanks, guys. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. All right.
and I'm gonna put 30 rounds through this guy right here. And then what I'm gonna do is we're gonna take it up to the uh, Ah, I'm all over the place.